Hey everyone, welcome to Yochi. I'm Marissa and this is our Qigong routine to purge and tonify. So purging is a way to detoxify and cleanse the body of any kind of negative or stagnant or toxic qi energy in the body. Now this can manifest as chronic tension, pain, uh, chronic fatigue, stress, anxiety, toxic emotions, stomach aches, allergies, you name it. Um, just general imbalances in our energy system and in our body. You can take the test and test your chi at yochi.com. So in this routine, we're going to purge and tonify. Tonify means to strengthen the chi, to make it nice and balanced and nice and strong. And we want to do these purging and tonification exercises generally in the beginning of a qigong practice before we move into circulating the chi. So find a warm, comfortable place, join me, let's purge and move our chi. Begin standing with your hands over your lower abdomen. Close your eyes and bring a smile to your face. Allow the smile to spread through your eyes and shine through your heart. Smiling energy is an active ingredient to purge the body of anything we no longer need. Relax your chest and sink your breath down into your lower abdomen. Take some nice deep belly breaths here feeling present in your body and ready to create transformation. Open your eyes and step out a little wider than your shoulders and raise your arms up into a T shape. Now as you turn to the left, extend the right hand with the right palm facing up. As you turn to the right, extend the left hand with the palm facing up. Move from the hips and waist and imagine that you are tossing a ball. Inhale when the torso faces forward and exhale when you toss. Inhale through the nose and exhale out the mouth using the purging breath. There's a slight pumping through the legs as you twist and toss. This is called chi clearing and is an excellent purging exercise for cleansing stagnant energy from the skin, the muscles, and internal organs. As you inhale, imagine drawing pure clean energy up your legs and into your lower abdomen. And then as you exhale, imagine dark toxic energy like a dark smoke flowing out of your palms and into the center of the earth. Visualize this energy becoming lighter and lighter with every toss until the energy becomes a pure white light. Keep moving through it, relax the shoulders, Feel the spinal joints warming up and slow it down. Come back to the center and notice how your body feels. Next, interlock your fingers and begin to move and circle your wrists. Just spiral the wrists in all directions back and forth and then we'll expand this movement into the elbows and the shoulders. So draw your right elbow up towards the sky, make a big circle, and then draw the left elbow up and around. Feel how this opens the rib cage and the spine, as well as the shoulder joints and the wrists. This is called rooster spreads its wings and is a dynamic stretch and twist that releases wind in the joints and in the digestive organs. Use your hips and waist to guide the movement. As the right arm goes forward, the right hip goes forward. Then as the left arm goes forward, the left hip goes forward. Now let's reverse the direction. So take the right elbow down and circle up and around, moving from the hips and the waist. So as the right arm goes back, the right hip goes back. Then as the left hip draws back, the left arm moves back. Relax your body and breathe into the flow. Now slow it down and come back to the center. Keep your fingers interlocked, spiral the hands and press your hands forward, round the back, 
then inhale, palms move back towards the chest. Again, exhale and press forward, opening the back of the lungs, and inhale, gather chi into the front of the lungs. Exhale, release old or stagnant chi, and inhale, take in chi. This time, exhale, press, and then stretch your arms up over your head. Come up onto your toes and lift through the body, drop down. Do that again, lift up on your toes, and down. This is a great way to activate the feet and ground your energy. Now lean over to the right, press into the feet and stretch. Come back to the center and lean to the left side. Take a nice deep breath, stretch and make space. Move back to the center, reach and slowly relax your arms down by your sides. Now let's do some shaking. So shake out your wrists your arms, shoulders, relax through the hips, and shake with your whole body. Shaking is a purging exercise that lets go of stress and tension in the body, so we'll use the cleansing breath with the six healing sounds to get it all out. So inhale through the nose and exhale out the mouth and make the lung sound. Inhale, and exhale the kidney sound. Inhale, and exhale the liver sound. Inhale, and exhale the heart sound. Breathe in and breathe out the spleen sound. Inhale, and exhale the triple warmer sound. Good, relax and let go. Letting go of bound up tension, letting go of worry, doubt, frustration, any emotions that are not serving you just shake them off, like a tree shaking off old leaves. Purging exercises are a way to cleanse and prepare the body to circulate our energy. Take another cleansing breath and slow the movement down. Become still and notice how your body feels. Feel that happy chi buzzing and tingling around your cells. Next, place your hands over your lower back and begin to circle the hips. Loosen up the pelvis. Press in with your thumbs as you circle forward and release as you come back and give yourself a little lower back massage. The hips and pelvis are an area that store deep emotions, so we want to keep this area nice and loose. Let the chi flow. Now switch and circle the other way. Make a big circle with your hips. Just breathe into it. Feel the space and mobility opening in your pelvis. Use awareness, making a full circle all the way around. Then come back to the center. And now just knock over the lower back. Knock over the kidneys. Go up and down the lower back all the way over the kidneys and down to the sacrum. Knocking breaks up any stagnation of chi and it's also invigorating. So let's knock down the outside of the legs all the way down to the outside of the foot and wrap around up the inside of the leg. Really get that groin area. Then come around to the sit bones and we'll knock down the back of the legs. Knock behind the knees down the calves 
and then again up the inside of the leg and come up to the groin. Now just knock over the groin with a light fist and here we're gonna bend and straighten. Bend and straighten. This is a purging exercise, so breathe in through the nose and exhale out the mouth, releasing any toxins, anything that you don't need. And now we're going to knock and slap, knock and slap, opening up the quad, the leg gates. We're getting that circulation flowing through the hips. Keep breathing through it and then slow it down. Now just hold your hands over your hips and feel the sensations. Close your eyes and breathe that energy all the way up the back into the brain. Swirl it around the third eye and let it melt down the front of your body like warm honey all the way down through your feet into the earth. Beautiful. Now we'll move up to the upper torso. So let's knock on the liver on your right side. This is a great way to wake up the organs. So say hello liver, then knock on the spleen. Letting go of worry, letting go of doubt. Move up to the chest. This is the heart and thymus gland. Take some nice deep breaths and then extend one arm out and tap on the lung points. Then cup your hand and slap down the inside of the arm. Slap all the way down to the palm Flip the arm and slap up the outside of the arm all the way to the shoulder. Again, slap down the inside of the arm. This is the yin side and then come up the outside of the arm. This is the yang side all the way to the shoulder. Now move to the other side, knock on that lung point and then cup and slap down the arm, invigorating the body's energy. Feel how this opens all the pores in your skin. Take a nice deep breath. Good. Bring it up to the shoulder. And float your arms down to your sides. Notice how your body feels. Now inhale, float the arms out over your head, palms touch, and slide around the back of the neck. Then sweep down the front of the neck, backs of the hands together down the center line of the body, wrap around to the kidneys, rub the kidneys, and then down the outside of the legs, around the foot, up the inside of the calves, inner thighs, hips, and center in the lower abdomen. Again, inhale. Gather heavenly chi in your hands and exhale down the back of the neck, soothing the nervous system. Backs of the hands together, around to the kidneys, rub the kidneys. And then down the outside of the legs, using your palms to seal up any leaks, any holes or imbalances in your energy field. and center in the lower dantian. Last time, we're doing a yin massage here, smoothing out the chi. Bring it down to your lower back, then bend forward, and you don't even need to touch the body. You can just hover your hands, smooth out the magnetic field around your skin, draw it up to the belly, and center the energy in your lower dantian. Then bring the palms to face each other in front of your lower abdomen and just pulse on the chi. As you inhale, move your hands open to the sides. As you exhale, bring the palms closer together. Use your whole body to breathe. As you open, feel the space expanding between your hands as you close your hands, feel the resistance. When you inhale, visualize the chi spreading into every cell of your body and gathering in the lower dantian. Go at your own pace. Let the movement of your breath determine the movement of your body. 
Allow your arms to rise higher and higher as each breath fills your body like a balloon. Be open and receptive. Whatever quality of energy you might need today, just let it flow through you. Then imagine your hands come together around a ball, a ball of energy you are holding right in front of you. Keep your fingers open so the energy can flow. Your palms are facing each other and softly pulse the ball three times. Then rotate the ball and pulse three times. Rotate the other way and pulse three times. Then you can start rolling the ball continuously from top to bottom and bottom to top. Keep rolling the energy ball between your hands and imagine that your body is part of the energy in the ball and that the energy in your body is being totally renewed. Then bring the ball back to the center and imagine that light expanding in your arms. It's so light that your palms float up to the chest, the elbows relax down, and arrive in a standing meditation position. So the arms are round as if you are hugging a big tree. Relax your shoulders, elbows, and wrists. Allow space under the armpits so that the chi can circulate from the torso out through the hands. Feel that length going up the back of the neck. The head feels light. Soften your hips and allow the tailbone to gently sink towards the earth. Relax your knees. The knees face the direction of the toes so that they do not collapse inwards. Feel the strength of your legs while at the same time relaxing and grounding down into the earth. The breath is soft, smooth, and even. When we relax the chest, the breath will naturally sink into the lower abdomen. Become still and simply be aware of the position of standing. Then notice what arises. This posture is called Jan Juang and is a great purging exercise that quickly reveals where we are holding unnecessary tension, stress, or toxins in the body. So you can use your mind to scan your body with awareness. And wherever you find any unnecessary tension, just allow it to sink down and dissolve into the earth. Like a tree, you can feel your feet rooted and connected to the earth. Your arms are like the branches absorbing light from the sun. Breathe all that healing energy into every pore of your skin and let it gather in your lower abdomen. Now slowly release your hands down in front of you and place your attention in your hands. On an inhale, float the arms out to the sides, relax the shoulders, and spiral the hands to face the sky. And then exhale, hands float down the front of the body. Inhale, take in heavenly chi, and exhale, wash that chi through the crown of your head and down your body. Energy is abundant all around you. Be open and receptive and let it flow through you. Last time, take in heavenly chi and exhale, wash that chi through the crown and down the body. Then interlace the web of your thumbs and bring both hands over your lower abdomen. Step your feet together and take some nice deep breaths. Breathe all the way down into your center. Sink your mind into your lower abdomen. Just relax down through your legs and into the earth and allow yourself to rock and sway. Notice how your body knows how to come back to balance. Smile at your lower abdomen. Smile at nature all around you and take this feeling of rejuvenation and purity 
into the rest of your day.